everyone oh, welcome back and thank you so much for watching i feel like it's been like a hot minute since i've done a makeup tutorial and today makeup look is on this beautiful look that i have going on and it's a talk through a makeup tutorial means this video is going to be slightly long guys i would definitely recommend you guys a bunch of morphe brushes but that will be in the part two video and that will be uploaded right after this video stay tuned for that so this video is going to be cut into two so grab yourself a cup of tea bust out your makeup and let's get started Okay, if you want to know how I create this look, just keep on watching. So let's start with this eyes. First thing you want to do is conceal your eyelids. I'm using the LA Girl Pro Conceal and don't mind my fingernails. I've not done my fingernails, so... And actually, this is the second time I actually I'm filming this uh, blue look. It's because the first time when I filmed my blue look, I actually didn't like the way it looked. I can show you a photo right now of how previously my blue looked and how I actually did my eyes now. Okay, so I'm actually going to use the Jaclyn Hill palette right now. I know I'm kind of zoomed in. I'm just going to set my entire eyelids. You can set it with a normal setting powder or an eyeshadow. So I am picking up Silk Cream with my M504 brush and this is a very big and fluffy brush as you can see. So you can just like dab it and just and set the concealer. I really like this technique by using an eyeshadow to set the concealer is because it gets the eyeshadow blended properly. Okay, so for the very first shade, I will be picking up Hunt. It's a very burnt orange shade. So I'm picking up with my M412 brush. It's actually a tapered brush. As you can see, the tip, it gets really, really precise to what I want to do. And then as you can see, I am just going along my crease line. Just right there. Just above. I don't want to bring it too low and too high. As you can see, it's just at the crease area. And if you need more product, just go ahead and build this product up. And then in between each shade, you do want to blend out in between each shade so it doesn't look very harsh. So I'm using, I'm going back with my 504 brush. And I'm just blending out the edges because I don't want my edges to look very harsh. Just like that. With my M433 brush, I'm picking up the shade called Royalty. It's a purple shade. And I'm just going to slowly build up this purple shade because it's a shimmer shade. So you got to be very careful. If this is a matte purple, it would have been better. But this is a shimmer purple. So you don't want to go in a, with a really heavy hand. And just blend this right along the crease area as I'm doing right here. Just keep blending it out. You can see the purple. Just keep slowly blending this shade out. In any smoky eye, you do have to take your time because blending is everything. You don't want your eye like to look really really harsh so going in back with my m412 brush and i'm just picking up a little bit of hands and just blending this out really nicely i have seen a lot of people use this morphe brush which i used it previously is the m167 brush it doesn't really pick up the product properly so i'm actually going to use Another brush which is not Morphe is the Essence Oval brush. It really really picks up the product properly and you don't need to wet your brush when it comes with this brush. So as you can see it really just deposits the product really nicely. And you just want to pack this all over the lid area. And then going in with a more precise brush and picking up a little bit of twerk. This shade is twerk, I'm sorry I didn't tell you guys. And then I'm just going to go and blend out the edges. And then as you can see as I blended the product actually went away. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna apply a bit more. It always goes away and when you every time you are blending, especially when it comes to shimmer shade, it just becomes a little bit sheer. Just need to put a little bit more product on. And then I am going to go in with my M431 brush and pick up a little bit of pool party. 
tap it in the center of the lid. It's a little bit of a halo situation, but I like I like this combination. Don't you think so? It's really, really nice. I like this. And then just go in a little bit more with twerk and just blend out the edges. Apply a little bit more of a blue party. It's more of really blending out the products together and actually picking the right shade to blend out your products and then to finish everything off guys i'm going in with the m321 brush picking up a little bit of soda pop a very dark purple it's not black and then we'll just go along the edges right there and then we just slowly blend this out And then we are actually done guys and as you can see it's really blended out nicely but I'm just gonna go in a little bit more with Hans and just blend out the edges right here and smoke it out. I really like this combination guys. Eyeliner, I'm going in with Essence Liquid Ink and this is a waterproof eyeliner. I'm not good with my eyeliner, that's I always go in with the tip because I do not want to even do a little mistake to ruin my eye look. Not even the tiniest bit. Go in with lashes, so I'm actually using the Adele 120 Demi Black Lashes Adele Lash Grip. Okay, eyebrows. I use two types of eye pencil. First, I'll go in with the Essence Designer in the shade Black. And I will actually outline my brows. I'll just keep outlining it in small, small strokes. Actually, for my brows, I really have nice full brows. I just don't need to overdraw my brows. I just need to fill them in. And for the front part here, as you can see, empty, I'll go in with my Australis eyebrow pencil in the shade Dark Brown. And then I will just do small flicking strokes in front. And just fill them in. Then if you need to, just brush through them. For my brow highlight, I'll be going in with the M169 brush. And picking up the shade Obsessed, just highlight my brow bone. Just on the high points. And the eyes are done guys, so let me go and do my face and I'll be back. Okay, so my entire face is done. I am going to smoke up my lower lash line. And for my lower lash line, I am going to use the E36 brush. I am going to pick up twerk. So I'll be really careful. And I'm just going to smoke up my outer right here. My outer and my inner corner. And just leaving the center here empty and then they do the same for the other side and then for the center right here I'm actually gonna try this new thing with the same M431 brush I'm picking up Pool Party just at the tip and I'm gonna smoke out my lower lash line hoping this turns out well Wow, I've never done anything like this before guys. Oh, I really like the way how the bottom is. I'm just gonna go ahead and apply my waterline. I'm using the Matte Lash Black Mascara from The Balm. Yes, 
For my lips, I'm actually going in with the Morphe shade in Peanut. Okay. So if you do like this video, give this video a huge thumbs up and hit the button down below and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!